Hi, this is Preeti from Analytics India Magazine. Welcome back to another episode from our segment, Data Science as a Career. And in today's episode, we will be talking about the hiring process of data scientists at Siemens Healthcare. Siemens Healthineers is the mother company for several medical technology companies. At the entry level, they also offer internships to students and then absorb them based on their performance. Gerd Hofner, MD and President at Siemens Healthcare, says that they carefully assess educational qualifications, the relevance of project experience and the impact of the candidate's contribution when hiring for data science positions. They look for candidates who have strong foundation in mathematical concepts and an in-depth knowledge of core subjects of data science. Furthermore, preference is given to candidates who have a passion for learning state-of-the-art developments, especially in related digital technologies. Additionally, for senior role, candidates should have made original contributions and innovations to their past projects. Hofner said that they also look for recognition by the data science community in terms of accepted papers, patent filings, and so on. Hofner also says that having prior experience in healthcare is an advantage, but this is not a blocker. However, candidates should have a thorough understanding of the system for which they did the data analytics work. So let's go ahead and look at the five-step hiring process at Siemens. The hiring process for data scientists at Siemens comprises multiple rounds of technical interviews. Round one is a telephonic interaction. Here, the company attempts to assess the candidate's basic understanding in data science as well as the relevance of their work experience against the open positions at the company. Coming to the round two, assessment skills. In this round, there is a thorough evaluation of the candidate's skill, which include data science fundamentals, analytical and architectural skills, and implementation and deployment expertise. The first part, they look at the candidate's conceptual understanding of mathematical topics, followed by a focus on the technical skills required for the role and specific projects. For example, a candidate may be assessed on time series prediction if the project is on machine log analytics. However, for a project related to customer issue analytics, they would be assessed on NLP techniques. The company takes several case studies and the candidates are expected to come up with a complete solution. With that, they're able to demonstrate relevant skills acquired by their previous projects. Hofner also said that they expect candidates to explain the rationale behind their design decisions, choice of approaches, and the selection of tools. Lastly, they also focus on other aspects such as implementation issues, challenges faced, and lesson learned. If you clear the first two rounds, then you move on to the third round, which is to test your programming skills. Testing programming skills is essential for specific project requirements. Hofner said it is usually a written test based on a selected programming language such as Python, R, or SQL. Following these three rounds, there are other two rounds to assess behavioral and cultural fit. And these two rounds are also very important. I can give you an example here. When I was working as a recruiter, we had a candidate who is very good technically. So in the third round, when he was given a problem and asked to give a solution, the head of the department gave him a few suggestions as to how he should go with the project. But the candidate was so overconfident that he kept dismissing the suggestions given by the head. So although the candidate came up with a solution, he was rejected in the next round. The sole reason being, he was never going to be a team player and would never take suggestions from anybody working in his team. With that, we come to the end of this video. Don't forget to subscribe to Analytics India magazine and follow this segment for everything related to data science as a career. See you soon. Bye.